Hey friends, welcome back to Turnover Ranch. In today's video, we are gonna show you a little bit of the fencing progress we've made around the ranch. From February to August, 2024, we'll show you a few clips from here and there. Starting out with the entrance, there was a huge mud hole and it was challenging just to get in the property. We started with a few loads of gravel and cutting down some brush to get in. We finally moved in. Now it's time to tear out old fencing. Lots and lots of old fence posts, lots of old wire. To pull up, little by little, we will conquer it. Still, there's plenty to do, but we're grateful for the progress we've made. We bought some pipe, some wire, and lots of new fence posts and started to get to work. Here's a photo and a little video to show you just before we got started. Our first big project was fencing up the driveway. So we started by drilling some corner posts to pull lines and we started on the entryway. We're super thankful for the family who came out over July 4th weekend. They offered to take off their holiday and work with us. We're so grateful for all of their labor and their love shown to us over this weekend. We had supplies ready, all the corner posts set and wire strung. So they set a bunch of T post, clipped wire for many, many hours and then pulled out a bunch of old fencing out behind the barn as well. 
We're so thankful for the labor of love that these folks showed to us. And there you go. There's the south side of the driveway. The fence is complete. It looks mighty fine. I love a good straight new fence. Cody did such a good job at preparing everything and getting the supply set, and our family were a wonderful help along the way. The weekend after July 4th, we had some kind folks come out of Paris, Texas, who wanted to help. They came up for the weekend and helped us complete the entryway. Travis helped Cody by pulling out the old fence and old wire while Cody welded up some of the new um, corner posts and the sucker rod for the entryway. Here's a little before and after photo and video so you can see the progress we made over the last six months. We can't wait to do an overhead and a gate with many more fence lines in the months and years to come.